Hello everyone, welcome to WB Vrim. In this video training, I am just going to work with a visual CSS style editor and it's called YOLO Pencil. It's a premium plugin and you can get it from codecanyon.net. I have just provided the referral link in the video description. Well, using this plugin, you can edit the style sheet of your WordPress website live visually. Okay, I am just going to show you. It, how can I visually change the style sheet of this website here I'm on the dashboard of my WordPress website and from the plugin section I'm just going to click on add new to install a plugin I'm just going to upload the plugin I have downloaded and just choose the file here goes the YOLO pencil plugin I'm just going to hit install now button okay just active the plugin well i could successfully install your pencil visual css editor plugin now i'm just going to head over to the setting section before i edit the template visually here it shows the css method all use i just you can just choose dynamic inline css but sometimes inline css doesn't work well it may not it may cause the rendering issue so i'm just going to select a static external css file so hit save changes button and custom animations customizations okay let's see i'm just going to refresh this page and as i'm logged into this site you can see a menu on the top bar called edit with yellow pencil i'm just going to just hit this button edit with yellow pencil it will take a few seconds just initialization this plugin has a very simple interface this plugin has a very simple interface on the left side it has some toolbars it has some tools and on the right a uh, customization panel from here you will just customize the css property okay firstly begin with this wb brim text logo if i click on it you can see it instantly show up the css properties but it has some customizations type single customization template customization and global customization if you select single customization it will work only for this web page this page if you say if you select template customization then it will work for this post type and global customization it will affect the whole entire website okay i'm just going to choose single customization and as i clicked over this text logo and it instantly showed this css properties firstly under text properties i can see the following things i can just change the font family okay here you can see and font width is 4 100 but you can choose to bold 600 and text color is black but you can choose any color from the select option you can choose flat color material color and current color okay i'm just going to choose from flat color and thus this color you see the color changes instantly i'm just going to choose red so that you can understand it changes here and now i'm just going to add text shadow you can just add text shadow you see the text shadow and if you just don't like the text shadow just click over here it will just undo and font size you can just increase or decrease the font size just drag it on the right to increase the size and drag it left 
to decrease the size and line height you can set line height just like the font size drag this bar onto the right to increase the line height and drag it left to decrease the line height and text line you can bring it to center or left and letter spacing you can increase the letter spacing or just decrease it okay and that's all okay now i am done with this what i'll have to do just hit the save button okay now if you just what should i say reload this space it will work until you keep this yellow pencil plugin activated let's see how can i change the link color okay just come here click on this click here and bring it again text color i'm just going to choose the flat color well you can see it changes the color instantly okay just select this color and i'm just going to change the font size okay you see the font size increase instantly and you can see it live and letter spacing okay if you are happy with it you can just hit the save button well let's see some other options i'm just as you can see there is a large picture i'm just going to resize this picture just click on it you can see the size option i'm just going to drag it down i'm just going to increase or decrease the size you can see i can manage the image size i can make it smaller or large okay and height i can customize the height okay and what should i say let's see border radius i'm just going to add border radius to this image okay let's see how can i add animation i'm just going to choose this animation and you see the image spins and i'm just going to set it pulse okay here goes it you can just change the animation delay and animation duration everything okay and the animation fill mode towards forward and both and if you don't like this you can just undo from here okay i'm just going to set it again to zero aha uh -huh. and hit save changes okay just now minimize it if i want to just increase or decrease this size or color of this section i'm just going to click on it as you can see all the properties shows up here i'm just going to add margin just as you can see it adds left margin i can also add right margin and margin top margin bottom so it's possible to just change the style sheet of any element of your wordpress website understanding color i'm just going to change the color just text color red color 
okay and you can change the padding at left padding at right padding at top padding at bottom padding and if i don't like it just undo it undo it okay so just box shadow i'm just going to add animation okay it's cool I'm just going to save it, minimize it, and let's see other pages. What about contact page? You can see the contact form is too large. I'm just going to minimize it. Just edit with yellow pencil. okay i'm just going to select the entire form and size well you can see the size are now half of the page i'm just going to save okay you can see the contact form is half of the page just uh, use us reload it again and it will be saved until you keep this yellow pencil plugin activated now i'm just going to check this about page and here goes the team member images i'm just going to edit this uh, let's try this image i'm just going to what should I say? Drag something out of it and drop here. Well, you can just drag and drop. It's easy to drag and drop any images. okay just add border radius i can just here you can see the border radius is applied to this image and all of these images and bottom border radius now it looks cool i'm just going to hit save so you can see how i change the style of any artfish web page using yellow pencil okay now you can see the team member image is completely changed okay let's see how can i do something just click on it and change the position You can see I can change the position and I'm just going to choose this social media buttons just this text box and seconds the position I'm just going to bring it top bring it button everything is changeable using this plugin well just change the name Whatever you can just want to change the color of this role, and I'm just going to add color to it just flat color or metallic color. Okay, and you see all the color changes, and let's see the box shadow. I'm just going to apply box shadow to the image. Just select this image and 
select this image and apply box shadow blur radius you can see i have added blur radius to this image and spread spread change the spread position inner outer and you can also change the color i'm just going to change to any metallic color or this one as you can see it's visible it's really cool to edit the css visually of your wordpress website using this yellow pencil plugin i'm just going to check the extra options filter just apply to this image and you can see the images are blurry okay and transform scale up scale up okay so i hope i could show you all the css property sections and now let's see the tools here uh, you can just change the cursor type and here is the find section to find any element by class id or html tag here you will see all the html code we have generated to customize the style sheet of this page and here goes the responsive mode you can say it how is it responsible and it's a measuring tool if you click on any element it shows up the height and width of that okay and it goes wireframing you can see the wireframe of this website and here goes the design information here goes animation generator you can generate or generate animation and if you do some mistake you can just undo of your work and redo of your work here you will see the customization okay high performance you see the styles remains live and from the dashboard you can see the customizations here goes the customization i customized on home page contact page and about page if you don't like the customization of this about page you can just delete the css code from here okay if i delete it just hit delete and re reload it you see all the work is removed you can just keep backup of the style sheet just hit download css file and you can open it you will find all the css files and if you uninstall this plugin just deactivate now come to this page now you see it doesn't exist so um, if you would like to work with yellow pencil you will have to keep it activated but that will be fine and if i as i have activated again and reload it it works so i hope you could work with this plugin and customize your website thank you for watching don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel thank you